Fortnite's next big upcoming collaborations have officially been revealed and today we're going to be showing you guys all the upcoming skins, cosmetics, free rewards, quests, mythic weapons, and pretty much everything you need to know about these upcoming events. And of course we need to head to the shop so we can send our daily gift to a lucky subscriber. We did get some brand new Terminator skins in the shop yesterday so of course we're going to go ahead and send the brand new skin as today's gift. If you guys want to receive a gift in a future video all you have to do is drop a like, make sure you are subscribed to the channel with notifications turned on and also leave your epic usernames down in the comments below so I can add you and send you the gift and a big shout out to everyone using code nerf2 in the fortnite item shop you guys are absolute legends and the support really helps me out so thank you so much Today's video is very exciting because there is two brand new collaborations that are on the horizon coming here into Fortnite Battle Royale and one of these is actually a brand new anime collaboration which I know a lot of people seem to really really enjoy here in Fortnite. Why did I land up here? There's literally no loot. Alright, we got a key. Give me something good, please. Oh, I don't know if I should take the shotgun or the AR. Oh, we're gonna take the AR, man. Screw it. We don't need a shotty. Oh, pop this guy. Boom. We hit those, baby. We hit those. Now, this all started when a big leaker page over on Facebook actually revealed information about upcoming collaborations that ended up being correct here so far this season. They actually were the first ones to predict the upcoming Transformers collab that's going to be coming in October, and they are the ones that actually shared this brand new information with us yesterday. But they did confirm that the upcoming anime collaboration is between Fortnite and an anime called Jujutsu Kaisen. I really, really apologize because I know I probably butchered the name. It, I probably said that so wrong. So correct me in the comments and let me know how to say it. But yeah, that is the anime that Fortnite is doing their next big collaboration event with. And based off the leaks, we actually have all the screenshots of what the cosmetics are going to look like in the item shop and when this collaboration is actually going to be taking place. It's a lot closer than many people are thinking. Oh, juked him out. He didn't see me jump up here. What? There we go. How is that first? Dude, I don't even know how that first one didn't kill him. But I will throw the images up on the screen. And as you guys can see, here is the three different cosmetic sets and bundles that are going to be coming out. And this is exactly what they're looking like in the item shop when this collaboration does end up dropping. Also tweeted and confirmed saying it appears that each skin will cost 1500 V-Bucks. Each pickaxe will cost around 800 V-Bucks. The two emotes will be sold together for 200 V-Bucks. This is due to the price of the bundle only increasing by 200 with the emotes, making me curious if it's a situation where you can't buy only one emote and you have to buy both. Unless they sell each emo on its own for 100 V-Bucks, which is something that uh, rarely ever happens in Fortnite, so that's why people are speculating that they're probably going to just be sold together as a bundle. Now, I'm not going to lie to you guys. I've never seen this anime. I've never even heard of it until I started researching for this video, so I don't know the characters' names, but obviously the three different skins you guys can see here, I'm guessing are three of the main characters in the show itself, and I'm sure that you guys that watch anime and have seen it probably know exactly who the skins are. So let me know down in the comments below, what's the name of all these different characters coming into Fortnite? I'm curious if any of you guys watch the show or know anything about it. Oh, there they are. Okay, there's one dead. Where's this other guy at? Now, although the release date is not confirmed, if you guys actually zoom in on these bundles, which I do apologize for the watermarks, the guy that leaked this decided to leave the biggest, fattest watermark possible. Like, you literally could barely even see the skins. But if you guys zoom in on the actual text and descriptions for these skins in the shop, you guys can see that it says they are supposed to release in Chapter 4 Season 3, which does confirm that they're probably going to be coming out in the final update of this season, since we are on the tail end of season three. So that is some pretty exciting stuff because that does confirm that we are going to be getting one more big hoorah and event before the end of this season and it would give us a lot of momentum and hype going into the brand new season which is chapter four season four. Oh we got some swimmers. Boom. Oh this uh, I'm so glad I ended up taking this assault rifle man. This thing is a beam.
There we go. Let's. <laughs> he tried to hit us with a grenade launcher, man. Get out of here. We just launched our brand new creative map, which is Only Up BMX Edition. It is pretty self explanatory. It's a new version of Only Up, except this time around, we made things a lot more difficult, and you actually have to complete it on a bike. So if you guys think you can complete the challenge and set the world record for the quickest time, make sure to hop in, check it out, and send us tweets and screenshots of your guys' times you're getting. We would greatly appreciate it. Now, just like the previous anime collaborations we've seen Fortnite do, although all the information we have is based around the cosmetics, this is set to be a pretty big collaboration. So there's a very good chance that we could be seeing some exclusive quests with bonus rewards come out a part of this update. And it is very likely that we'll probably be getting some type of new mythic weapons or abilities a part of this collaboration as well. If you look back at every single anime collab Fortnite's done, Every single one has included at least one brand new mythic item or weapon or ability in the loot pool. And I don't think Epic is going to stray away from this because the mythic weapons and abilities are genuinely my favorite part. And I think a lot of people can agree that that's honestly the best part of a lot of the anime collabs we've seen. So I don't think they're going to stop doing it during this one. Now again, I've never seen the show, so I don't really know what type of weapons or if there's any like things they use in the show itself. But I'm guessing that whatever weapons or whatever the main characters use to fight, that's probably what they're going to be adding into Fortnite if they do end up making a mythic weapon or ability. Bang. What? There we go. I was like, how are those not doing damage to them? Now, the second collaboration that was also leaked by the same leaker over on Facebook here is another one Is another one that I think a lot of people are going to really enjoy. But it was confirmed by FN Assist over on Twitter who tweeted saying, More upcoming Fortnite collabs information, a very beloved and well-known anime, which of course that's the one that we just covered. And then he goes on to say, Fighters slash wrestlers in quotes WWE and then with also more icon series emotes coming out now the WWE collaboration does make a lot of sense mainly due to the dates and prior collabs we've seen them do with some WWE professional wrestlers and fighters in the past if you guys have been playing Fortnite for about a year or more now you would remember but about a year ago during early August is when John Cena was actually added into Fortnite with his own icon series skin you guys did not know John Cena is mainly known for being an actor now, but before he got big in Hollywood, he was one of the biggest and most famous WWE wrestlers and stars, which explains why he's so big and buff. Now, the entire reason Fortnite did this collaboration with the WWE and released him is because they did it for the SummerSlam event, which uh, I guess a which I guess for WWE is one of the bigger events they do every single year. And this is where it makes a lot of sense, is the SummerSlam for 2023 is actually taking place August 25th, which at the time this video is going live is only six days away. So a lot of people are speculating that they are going to be doing another collaboration with the WWE where they're going to release a bunch of brand new skins and icon series for a bunch of the active and more popular wrestlers that are wrestling in the WWE and especially for the upcoming Super Slam event. And that's obviously why they're doing the collaborations in the first place. So this is very exciting. I'm not really a big WWE fan myself. I don't watch it a ton. I used to watch it as a kid. I think it's absolutely hilarious. It's very entertaining. And there is so many different wrestlers and superstars a part of that sport that they could release as skins and cosmetics. So my question to you guys is let me know down in the comments below. Let me know out of all the different WWE stars out there, which ones do you guys want to have skins come out into Fortnite for the upcoming collaboration to promote the 2023 SummerSlam event that's actually taking place in Detroit. Bang, baby. That guy had no chance. Like, look, you don't even have to aim. You just kind of shoot near them and, the, and it, it, it still it, it does plenty. Dude, this gun is so good. Oh my. Oh my god, how'd that guy have so much health? What the? Yup, there we go. Ooh, my heart. My heart was pounding there a little bit. I am not gonna lie. That guy started bum rushing me. The moment I heard the drum shotgun, I thought I was a goner. That's all I got for you guys today. If you're excited for these upcoming collaborations, make sure to drop a like, subscribe to the channel if you're brand new, and we'll see you guys in the next one. We just got a free reward. We'll take it.